Beloved, today we gather to reflect on the profound narrative found in the book of Genesis, chapter 2, verses 4 through 25. This passage reveals the divine blueprint of humanity's creation, a story that speaks to the very essence of our existence and purpose. It begins with the formation of man from the dust of the ground, a humble yet powerful reminder of our origins and the breath of life that God has bestowed upon us. As we delve deeper, we witness the establishment of the Garden of Eden, a paradise filled with every tree that is pleasant to the sight and good for food. This garden is not just a physical location, but a symbol of God's abundant provision and care for His creation. It reminds us that God has placed us in environments where we can thrive and grow, surrounded by His blessings. In this sacred space, God places man and gives him a purpose, to tend and keep the garden. This act signifies that we are not just passive recipients of God's blessings, but active participants in His creation. Our work, our efforts, and our stewardship are integral to God's plan. It is a call to embrace our responsibilities with joy and dedication. The narrative then introduces the creation of woman from man's rib, highlighting the profound truth that we are created for relationship and community. God saw that it was not good for man to be alone, and in his wisdom, he created a companion, an equal partner. This teaches us the importance of companionship, love, and mutual support in our lives. Finally, we see the establishment of the first human relationship, a union that is both sacred and profound. The man and woman are united as one flesh, symbolizing the deep connection and bond that God intends for us. This union is a reflection of God's love for us, a love that is unconditional, selfless, and eternal. As we reflect on this passage, let us be reminded of our divine origins, our purpose, and the relationships that God has blessed us with. May we strive to live in harmony with God's creation, embrace our responsibilities, and cherish the bonds of love and companionship. Amen.